snow last night. Hi, Kesey. You are a frosty beast. Casey is trying to help Stacy plow. Hi. You have too many in the milk house because it's warm in here. I'm, I'm stocking up my warmness, though. That's how it Fresh sheets for the cows. They're gonna be inside all day, I'm pretty sure. So we made this video about how Winter came to the Tomarosa, and then Winter's like, let me send you more. So this is just from last night. It's about nine and a half inches, and it's still coming down. I think we can get up to 16 today is what they forecast. But we won't wait for that. We'll start plowing before then, as soon as we get some breakfast. I need to start the tractor to head out and plow. Let it warm up for a few minutes. But uh, for my birthday, Virginia got me these work tunes, which are hearing protection for the tractor. And they play music via Bluetooth, which I love. So thank you, Virginia, for my birthday present. And then uh, for plowing... The thing that you got to remember is you're not plowing for today's snow. You're plowing for like seven snowstorms down the road because you got to have somewhere to put that. The snow we've already had, I've made sure that when I plow, I push it way away from the edge of the road so I have room to put more snow. And so, luckily, now I have room to put today's snow because there's a lot of it out there. It's a little cold. While Stacy is working on plowing, I get to work on making paths. Like, I need to dig out this path that goes to the chickens. We have our chicken feed. We have our little path to the chickens. And let's see how they're doing. Hello, chickies. They're like, I think we'll just take breakfast in bed this morning and hang out in here. They're in their uh, molting stage, so we don't have a light on. We do have a water heater and they're just taking a nice winter break. Now that the chickens are good and I widened that path a bit, I also cleared snow in front of our meters because if we lose power, that's where we have to hook up the PTO generator.
We spent about three hours uh, removing snow and it's still snowing. So we'll be doing that again later tonight, but we do have the main driveways cleared and the pads for the animals cleared so they can get outside. And then once it stops snowing, we can really clean things up. But um, otherwise, we have access in and out of the farm, and the animals have access in and out of the barn. And we're going to go in and start a fire and warm up.